another quick update on the pond. Uh, recently, we found a bunch of toads. So, North American wood toads have shown up to breed in the pond. Shortly thereafter, we've noticed, I've noticed on some of my fish, especially the big white butterfly koi, a thing called uh, fish lice, which is a parasite that can live on your fish. I dealt with this two years ago, and I'm going to be evaluating here a new product called Proform LA that I got out of Canada. And I'll post the store I got it from here. Paid $49 for it plus shipping. This treats this bottle here is 32 fluid ounces, treating up to 10,000 gallons. So I know for a fact I see some lice on the fish, some larger pond lice. And what I'm going to do is do a treatment here and then we're going to review and see how this product works. Okay, so I've now added about nine ounces of this product. As you can see, it's crystal clear. This product also says it is safe for ornamental ponds, reptiles, turtles, amphibians, frogs, and other crustaceans. So what I'm going to do is take this product, add it to the pond, and then we're going to do three treatments over the next week. So what I'll do is keep an eye on the fish, and we'll do a, a treatment, the first initial treatment, and see how look how the fish look over the next couple days. Okay, I took the time to go into the pond, capture one of the fish, and I found these two. As you can see, these are the pond lice, or argillus, as they're scientifically called, I believe. You see two of them swimming around. So I got these guys swimming around in eight ounces of water, one cup or one little cap full of this Proform LA. Pour that in. Now I've other tried other chemicals that took forever to take these guys and kill them. So what I'm going to do is time it and see how long it takes for these guys to stop swimming. And that'll tell me whether this product works or not. Okay, we're at five minutes exactly into the treatment here and these two are still swimming around quite a bit there's one large one on the right here and one baby on the left now they're swimming around like they don't like it or they're swimming around like they're looking for a host but only time will tell we'll see what happens with them Okay, everyone, here's the quick update. So, I'm gonna have to link all these videos together. If you look at the bottom here, I'm just gonna rest this phone on top here. There we go. You see both the lice here down at the bottom, right between my fingers here. Both are dead. So, good news, but guess what? It took three days. Three days, these things swam around completely normally, like nothing was going on. So here's my questions. Did they die from lack of oxygen in the water because I didn't bubble it? Did they die just because they're not getting food or, or uh, die because the water quality changed like it does in an aquarium? Or did they die as a result of the Proform LA chemical? Uh, one treatment's been done. I'll follow my honor and, and do the full three week trial. Uh, however, if they come back, we I'm going to call BS on this product. I'm, I'm not impressed at all how fast it works when I put that much in 8 ounces of water. A whole cap full should have annihilated these things, in my opinion. If it was a Dimlin-related product, it would have been done in 10 minutes. Um, so let's uh, keep my evaluation going so it's appropriate. Uh, the only thing I could have done is maybe captured two more of these things and put them in a separate cup in the same conditions, same thing, and see if they're still swimming or they're dead as well. Uh, I kind of wish I would have done that and make a controlled experiment, I guess, but I didn't. Um, so for now, we are going to carry it on, and uh, I will go back to the pond for the next update and let everybody know how Proform LA actually does work in a pond. Thanks for watching.